Let's Play Syndicate. This game, it was supposed to be a reboot of an old game about a corporation. Corporations basically run the world. And there is a little intro thing that'll tell you all about the story once I click campaign because I just went through all that and my stream failed. So if you're watching this on Twitch, that's why there's two Let's Play Syndicates Part 1. Watching this on YouTube apply, doesn't apply to you at all. But this game came out in 2012. I think it was made by Starbreeze Studios. And it's an action shooter that has like technology based things. I don't know much about the game. I know I it was free with gold months ago. I've owned the game since about 2014 and I've never I've played the intro sequence but not even all of the intro sequence. I've only played a little bit of this game. So, <clears throat> let's get into this. That's why it says continue campaign because it, but it won't let me do chapter select because I only literally got through that cutscene. It's a new game. Yes. Normal. Here you guys go. In the year 2017, the world's largest corporate merger leads to the creation of Eurocorp. The company is the first to spearhead the development of a biodigital implant, the Dart chip. Fueled by adrenaline, its users experience unsurpassed connectivity with the Dataverse, rendering all digital devices obsolete. Nations lose their relevance in a world dominated by these massive corporations. The world population swells to 15 billion. 57% are chipped and linked to their preferred corporation. The rest are digitally locked out, out of sight and out of mind. Industrial espionage reaches unparalleled heights. Covert agents are mobilized to protect and serve their interests. You are one of the chosen few, an agent. Now, before I click A to start this and while it's loading, this game, for one, photosensitivity warning, because I do know there are a lot of flashing lights in this game. So, photosensitivity warning for anyone that might, you know, have epilepsy or suffer from epilepsy or might know people that suffer from epilepsy, so you don't even know if you do. Warning for that. Two, the reason it looks all weird is because this was a 360 game, so the resolution isn't like the high definition we see in games today, like the 4K whatever. So that's why it looks slightly odd, and it's because it's only in like 720, maybe 1080p. Roger that HQ. We'll begin wake-up procedure. Excuse me. Chip systems. Ow. 6.1. Initializing. Okay. It's time to wake up. I guess you could do the typical title for this like part one, Rude Awakening. Hey! Give me a minute, dude. Hey. Initializing dart overlay. Hey. Oh damn. I'm a bad ass. Oh. Agent feature. So reading. Oh, basic functionality. This is literally just the tutorial. Oh, okay. Press X until you succeed. Dark displays. Okay. Oh, wait. Mark is red. That dude's dead. Maybe. I said execute, but I kicked him in the jaw and headbutted him. Oh, yeah, see, this is why I like bright lights. Ow! Quit it! Oh man, you have to spam action. Typical first person shooter. There 
There you go. That's a feature of this hacking. The fact that I don't die from this is odd, because even with the body to cushion you, that's a long fall. I'm sorry, dude. He didn't die either. So, also think about this game. Everything has, like... A digital code I guess so you see it says crate beer bottle cardboard box pistol it'll say it on the ground whenever but it connects to everything so car garbage bag apparently everything is in the system hello my car me car so Sawan so on I don't know Age 51, position, nano-engineer, affiliation, Eurocorp, grade 23, or clearance, grade 23. I know, sir, no one can find Dr. Sawan. I've already tried that number a dozen times. Yes, I am aware of that, sir. I'll tell you what I told the secure... Okay, I was hoping there wasn't a thing that literally just says this. Okay. I'll tell you what I told the security commission. After he and Dr. Drawl came back from E... Oh, Reykjavik? And the C3 conference, Sawan uploaded all of his research data, and I mean all of it, to his personal computer and then left again. He told me he was going to our Boston facility and would be back in two to three days. No, sir. But apparently he never arrived, and it was the only day that he disco that we discovered. It was only the next day that we discovered he had wiped the database clean of everything published under his name. We got a team here trying to recover what they can, but it's not looking good. No, sir. They estimate 15 to 20 percent. Sir? Sir, are you there? End of entry. And yes, it is a typical shooter game whenever they give you stuff like that just to make... I don't want to waste a bullet. Why would I do that? I'm stingy. After the break, we take a look at how young you're... Search for propaganda. Spice up their dating. Don't go away. Oh. That is not where I shot. I didn't waste a bullet on a a lock, but I wasted a bullet on a TV. Uh neat. Huh, oh, another log. Jeez. Bobby Dalton. Fifty-six position. Not applicable affiliation, not applicable clearance unknown. So then I'll be the first to admit there are certain fundamental truths in life that must be grasped to get ahead. Most I can teach you nothing about, as I'm sure your mother has told you, but there's one area where I do possess some knowledge. Poker. Many will tell you poker is a game of chance, while others claim skill is the deciding factor. Both are wrong. Poker is a game designed to test the limits of human ingenuity. You need to outwit your opponents, but that won't happen as long as you play by their rules, not with the material and skill set you've got to work with. I'm being honest now, son, as an old man was with me. If you can't win with what you've got, well, you've got to find some other edge, don't you? Some will call this cheating, but the real name for it is adap adaptation. The same basic driving force that got humanity out of those caves and planted us firmly at the top of the food chain all those years ago. When your mother lets me visit next time, I've got some tricks to show you. Tricks that have served me well. I've got another game tonight, but I'll call tomorrow. If things go well, as I expect they will, I might even bring you a present. You might? What an ass. Intelligence? Eurocorp, Eurocorp consumers can rest easy knowing that the down zone terrorists known as Logos... Lagos... Logos! may soon be in custody. Early this morning, the Eurocorp security agency joined with city police to carry out a series of raids to tighten the noose around the murderer, believed to be responsible for the Diamond Hill bombing last month. That attack claimed six, over 600 lives and caused damage to Eurocorp in an excess of $120 million. 
According to today's official statement, members of terrorist cells responsible for the bombing have been under surveillance by Eurocorp for weeks before the swoop, and at least one agent was involved. As always, Eurocorp consumers are advised to avoid down zone at all times because remember, without chip technology, no one is ever safe. After the break, we take a look at how young Eurocorp consumers are using memory modification software to spice up their dating. Don't go away! Weapons, it's a pistol. You guys probably don't care about a pistol. <laughs> oh, and this is just tutorials. Plastic cup. Seems like the guy was a drunk and... I thought that was a tablet I could interrupt with. A drunk and a poker player. Alright. Hello? It's our first battle. Maybe. Exit is closed. A lot of vibration. Local power grid is offline. Reroute power. I was like, I can only assume I go up this ladder. Oh god, I'm looking straight up. Very power professional. Grid government detected in this vicinity. What? Oh, the door opened. Oh, hi. Oh, you're not dead? Jesus Christ, dude. Power on. Yeah, that's why these textures look, well, gross compared to what you would see today. It's because they're seven years old. Restored. Thanks. Yeah, that thing, the right bumper. Yeah, I know. It also slows down. That went better than expected. Hello? Is that everybody? Now let's hope. Oh, I pushed the door. That makes sense. Oh, shit. I see you up there. I'm a terrible shot. Oh, I can do this. that everybody? I mean, not absolutely everybody, obviously, but... Oh, you died, didn't you? Or are you ducking and covering? Nope, you're dead. You're 100% dead. Oh, that's everything. Alright, give me your assault rifle. Thank you. Down on the D-pad, so you switch firing. Got it. And they really don't care about people that don't have chips. Oh wait, is there a leaning feature? No. I'm guessing that makes it where you look through that and that make okay. No, no, oh what? Uh, I would reload the checkpoint, but uh, you are not dead yet. Sir. 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 Thank you. But there's obviously going to be more people. Hello? I keep saying that. Stay in your room! I know one of the features you can shoot through. Well, basically, walls. Is that dude just above me? Where is he? Oh! Oh! 
Oh shit. There's one. Excuse me. No. no. At least I got a headshot. Die. <laughs> I didn't think that was going to work. Hobo. <laughs> That's all they get to be known as. Isn't that nice? That's a weird way to sprint with your pistol out. I don't know who shot at me. While charging to move through a wall. Oh, I guess I gotta go that way. Yeah. Hi! Glad to have you back, Kilo. Let's get you in the chair. Security? Go ahead and clean up the proving grounds. Sit down, Wait, Kilo. Wait, what? I need your post-mission stats. Okay. Oh, nice chair. It looks kind of looks like Abstergo. Subject is secure. Data. Can I like tap my feet? Whoa, that's odd. Wait, uh, let me just. Unusual activity. I'm gonna have to keep an eye on that. Okay, this part is classified. But protocol states that- What? You're lecturing me on protocol for my project. Out! Oh. You're very I'm valuable. I'm a project. Everybody wants a piece of you. Tell you what, Kilo. How about Can I have a kiss? I give you something instead. Who is the kiss? Chip to chip upgrades initiated. Hello, Lily. You know Agent Merritt, don't you? Wow, wow. Famous Dr. Lily Draw. Hello, Jack. Merritt. This is a surprise. I want to see how my new prodigy is performing. Suicide? You know I've had my <laughs> doubts, but I've got to tell you, corner? Dart 6 looks promising. Shit? It's going to revolutionize the chip industry. And this guy, he just keeps on what? surprising us. Right, Kilo? Ready for assignment? He did well, but I'm still tweaking it. Time for tweaking is over, Lily. We need to talk mass implementation for Dart 6 and all agents. What we need is more time, Jack. We're not ready. That's not my impression. Kilo proved dot six works. Unless so, I'm missing something. Kilo, you just keep surprising us. Volunteering to sign up for the you prototype despite the risk of brain cancer. A real prodigy, all right. Or was it the thought of getting your head examined by the very lovely Dr. Droll? I mean, I don't know her very well. But... Yeah, I'd buy that. What? Nothing, Dr. Draw. Kilo. Lily here is not sure you're ready for a field mission. But Merritt thinks otherwise. And I'd like to find out if he's right. I've got this little thing coming up that you'd be just perfect for. Meet Gary Chang, chief psych engineer at Aspari. They're equivalent to Lily here. Except for the looks. My sources indicate he's working on something that's just a little bit too much like the Dart 6. It's a clear patent infringement. Actually, okay. it's worse than that. We're starting oh. to think that someone in our court is leaking data. I got a leak, a rat, a mole. Oh no, that's how not convenient. Possible. Well, the point is, if they beat us to the punch, their agents get the edge over ours. And I won't <laughs> permit that. Neat. I want this dealt with now. Everything's set. We're leaving tonight. You and me, Kilo. I don't like this, Jack. 
Kilo's not stabilized yet. He could glitch Your out. Your cop has an excellent safety record, Lily. You should know that. Kilo, go over to Aspari with Merit. Take care of this Chang you problem for call. me. We're on the verge of something great. Let's not mess it up. Someone fixed this up with an Aspari copter. It's waiting for us on the roof. Come on, show me how great you are. Okay. Okay. So a few more reading things. Jack Denham. Denham. Male, 61, 78 actual. So he's 78, but he looks 60. Er, in his thing, he says he's 61. Neat. Position, CEO, North American Branch, affiliation, Eurocorp, clearance, grade 30, executive manager. Background, Jack Denham was born when governments and politicians were still the norm, coming from a family of lawmakers and corporate leaders. When he was still a young man, his mother committed suicide after lured press coverage of an illicit affair, and his father retreated into his work. During university, Denham engaged in social studies, psychology, and economics, published multiple articles about how individuality corrupts social structures. When the syndicates arose as a global force, he embraced the change as the replacement of the mother and father he'd lost. Intel feed. Antitrust legislation archive Jonathan Denham. Jack Denham's father, Jonathan Denham, was a judge in the U.S. Supreme Court and died of cancer in 2019. Before his death, he managed the antitrust vote of 2018, where U.S. Con Congress rejected the Sherman Act and 70% of the existing antitrust laws in North America, opening the door for establishing syndicate control within the U.S. border. Jack Denham specialized early in corporate security systems and biotech and also made a name for himself as a savagely efficient operative, extracting and interrogating executives and specialists during field ops. In 2021, he attached himself to Eurocorp as they founded their North American branch. In 2065, he was on the third place of top influential world leaders, according to the World Poll Monthly. Rumors in state press indicate that Denham has access cellular-level technology to arrest his a Aging, augmenting his mental and physical capacities. Lily Drawl. Lillian Drawl, female, age 30, lead biotech engineer, Eurocorp, grade 15, biotech group manager. Born to Down Zone parents, excelled in Down Zone edu educational system and identified by Eurocorp intellectual talent scouts at the age of 16. Attended New Columbia Medical on Scholarship, distanced herself from family, particularly her brothers who demonstrated early corporate dissension and Down Zone anarchist traits. Regularly channels money to Lower Manhattan Down Zone address. R residential log indicates her parents as last known tenants. Okay, so she gives her parents money. Jules Merritt, age 31, 28 CGA, I don't know what that means, senior agent, New York office, Eurocorp, clearance, grade 16. Merritt was recovered from the New Jersey down zone in 2046 via standard channels at an estimated five and a half years old. He was already substantially older than most adoptees, and his life on the streets had rendered him almost totally feral. Merritt was initialized at nine years, three months of age. Then a record for EC, agent induction. Psychopathic deviations seem to feed well into the basic training, making him highly competitive and intensely task-focused. He was rapidly elevated to the advanced agent training yeah, in Geneva as a result. Field trials at age 14, if you're wondering the word I sk uh, skipped, it's C-R-E-C-H-E, -E, but this first E has a little line above it. I don't know what that thing is called. But I don't know how to say that, so. London and Budapest confirmed him as well ahead of the psychopa psychopathy and competence curve necessary for successful agent status. Preliminary Ops 2053, 57 Hel Helsinki, St. Petersburg, Moscow, Kiev. Full agent status conferred 2057. Subsequently distinguished himself as part of the EC Rapid Deployment Force, operating in that arenas as far afield as Osaka, 2059, Kuala Lumpur, 2061, and Melbourne, 2063. Became something of an expert in operations against Aspari targets as a result. Second to New York, 2065, with special 
remit remit for anti-aspari insurgency and strategic terrorism weapons a gun for tutorials oh new york new york new york city new york eurocorp ec manhattan office aspire city area five, da, 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 da. New York City, largest and most populous urban area of mainland USA, Eurocorp 2065 population survey identified over 45 distinct ethnic groups and 37 spoken languages in downzone districts. Upzone standardized to English speaking only after the skyward migration. Chip integration within upzone areas confirmed at 98.5%. Chip integration within downzone areas unconfirmed but believed to be sub 3%. Known subverter groups residing in down zone. TWB Towers Will Burn, believed to be a splinter of international terrorist group CONFA, current base of operations unknown. Okay. Social history? Syndicate agents, agent enforcers, business strategy, corporate growth, military operations. Agents, the latest generation of corporate enforcers, are based on engineered military veterans, enhanced, chipped, and designed to utilize prototype syndicate research. Intelligence indicate that design methods vary from bioengineering and chemical stimulation to cybernetic enhancement and robotics. Eurocorp slash Aspari, genetic customization and minor surgical implants, came in global TAO, TAO, IIA, cybernetics and inter internal industrial grade augmentations. The militarized DART 6.1 chip is under development by Eurocorp Agent Operations, Research and Development, New York. Black Stripe Security is in effect and all data handling the subject is subject to direct termination protocol. Social history. Type, world, corporate growth, social change. The world's largest corporate merger between Cater Industrian and Euroline Medical leads to creation of Eurocorp, the first mega corporation. Eurocorp in initiates the development of a biodigital implant, the DART chip, embedded in the brain stem and fueled by the host's own adrenaline. It provides the users with an unsurpassed connectivity with the dataverse. All features of personal communication are now embedded in the functionality of the chip, rendering all digital devices obsolete. More global corporations merge into syndicates and claim dominance, taking over all social and administrative functions of their consumers. National borders and local government are disbanded, and the new corporate borders become reality. Market shares rule. So it starts in 2017, Eurocorp founded. Eurocorp starts the biodigital, or creates the DART chip 2025. Basically, governments being shut down in 2032. 2044, world pro population surpasses 15 billion, where 57% are chipped and linked to the preferred syndicate, and the remaining 43% are digitally locked out of the dataverse. Lack of information and social support turn them into outcasts from modern society. 2057, industrial espionage reaches unparalleled heights, prototyped enforcers, agents, are mobilized to protect and serve the syndicate's interests outside the boundaries of modern law. An arms race to create the most sophisticated agents begins and syndicates go to war against each other. 2069. After 12 years of intensive research, Eurocorp launches a prototype host with the DART chip system version 6.1, evaluating the future evolution of syndicate agents. Next up, Spari South, City of Angels. I think you're gonna like this. Thanks. And I'm gonna. Oh, I am a weapon. Command me. And I'm gonna end that this episode there. Rank CEO. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this be and you're watching this on Twitch, be sure to follow me on Twitch so you get notified whenever I am online. If you're watching this on YouTube, if you liked it and you're not already, think about subscribing. If you want to see more stuff that I've done, there will be a link in the description below taking you to my other playlists. Ring that bell icon to get notified whenever I upload. Other than that, thanks for watching, guys. Tune into the next video of Let's Play Syndicate. Thanks for watching, guys.